Hi guys, and welcome along to episode 5 of our Let's Play series on ETS 2. So, last uh, episode we finished here in Mannheim. So we're going to continue, as we are currently on the road to 150,000 euros. We're currently sat at 90,700 um, I did do another job after the uh, last episode off screen so just to add a bit more money um, so yeah let's get a job get on the road and get earning some cash I nearly said dollars then but it's not dollars um, so let's take a look at today's job market. Oh, it would help if we selected our start in city. Cologne. Yeah, I think we can do that. Again, it's unlocking more of Germany, where we are based. It's either that, or we could head down into Switzerland, um, which could be a nicer option, actually. Let's go with Switzerland. Time to hit the road. Wee bit fast. Yeah, as always, guys, if you are watching this, if you're enjoying the content, um, smash all those buttons like, subscribe, comment, dislike, whatever you want to do. It all helps with the. Uh, YouTube algorithm and any feedback is most welcome certainly appreciate it if you are taking your time out to watch me play any of the games on my channel which at the moment is just this and car mechanic sim um, I think sometime soon there will be some farming content coming so it would be great to get another game on the channel and I've got some other ideas for games as well in the future so are taking the brake fluid five tons with the brake fluid which 
This trailer seems time to get the job done. Seems a bit excessive for five tons, but you know. Who are we to argue? Will at least be a nice light load. Rush hour. Go, go, go. Get ready to turn left. Turn left. Let's bring up the job sheet. Have a little look at that in a second. So as long as we don't get any problems, we're going to get just over five grand. In terms of rest, we're going to be fine, and we're heading to Zurich. So it should be pretty straightforward. Switzerland because of course you've got the uh, the mountain range there the Alps although I don't think we're quite going that far into Switzerland prepared to just keep driving past that turn.
do that in real life when I'm driving as well sometimes. Just completely zone out. Or you get those times where you drive somewhere and you get to your destination and you you think actually I wasn't even concentrating on what I was doing. I was just in autopilot. It's kind of scary sometimes because you think how have I just operated a, a vehicle driven somewhere and not even thought about what I was doing. It can be a little weird sometimes. that away into the folder I think we'll switch to a bit of GoPro give you guys a better view of uh, our surroundings Got a GoPro there as well, mounted on the side of the truck. Looking backwards. Beautiful day today. Not a cloud in the sky right now. Ninety-eight kilometers. Don't ask me what that is in miles. I mean, we use miles here in the UK, but I don't know how many miles are in a kilometer, or well, how many kilometers are in a mile.
Rottenburg. What a lovely name for a place. So we can stay in this lane. I don't think we've crossed into Switzerland just yet. Could be wrong though. No, because that's Dijon and Strasbourg, so uh, we are definitely still in Germany. Also got this uh, this GoPro here mounted on the side of the truck. Give you guys a unique wheel side view. Currently done 1,084 kilometers in this truck. Just make me wonder what player out there. There's there's somebody out there that plays this game that's got the most mileage on one truck. Wonder what that is. Or does it top out at a certain mileage? But yeah, post your mileages in the comments, guys. Like, what's the most amount of miles or kilometres that you've got on a truck? And we are now officially in Switzerland. I don't know if it tops out. If it's electronic, it might not, but if it's the old type, um, maybe it tops out, I don't know. Yeah, let, let us know your mileage. Let's see who's got the biggest. Going a little bit too fast into that. Uh, that was a bit of a bum clencher. 
very narrow off ramp as well, which made it worse. And now we've got a truck. I'm gonna have to, sorry, use the emergency lane there. No stop in that truck. truck here. left lane turn left. Nice. discovered turn the left. driver agency as well
bump the dock there. Get forward and square her up a little bit. saying they're happy with that, so, so am I. Oh, so close to that level up. Well, that's some more money. All right, let's have a quick look on the map and see if there's anywhere else we can open up here yeah there's a question mark there so let's go around and hit that whilst we're here let's go Be a dealership. Turn right. Get ready to turn left. Turn left and then keep right. Is a dealership. Just daft dealership. Can't sleep here, so we'll head around to. Uh, actually, let's uh, just out of interest. Yeah, see these start at 114, which with our 150, um, but we're aiming for 150,000, so we could still buy the DAF, I guess, instead of the um, Iveco. Or we save good lump of money and just buy the Iveco. Right, let's just take a look. That's up around there, so right and right again. And we'll head up there to the hotel. And call it a day. Just keep coming. I think we'll actually head to the uh, service area. Where we can just do the little bit of maintenance on the truck. And we can sleep there as well, so. Come on, I'm not even blocking the road. Really? I'm just gonna sit there.
Let's do the tiny bit of maintenance. But we like to stay on top of it. Right guys, I'm going to leave it there for this episode, as you can see, we're still on 90,000, um, we're sort of just covering our um, loan instalments for the days at the moment, but um, that will soon change, we just need to grind it out a little bit. <laughs> until we start earning some more cash on different runs and we'll level up and you know step by step we will make it to 150,000 that is still my goal um, technically it doesn't have to be that much but you know we might actually lower it um, because yeah, we only need 97,000 for the cheapest truck, so yeah, maybe 110 we could possibly survive. Um, but yeah, anyway, I digress again. Thanks for joining, guys. It's massively appreciated. If you like the content, please hit the like button, subscribe, and hit that notification bell. Um, but yeah, that's it for now, and see you next time. Bye-bye.